Actually, I think not he did. doing it all together. You know right, what I mean? Right. Yeah, he did make a conscious effort to not do it. And the fact that he turned himself in does tell you that he was actually trying to do it. Uh, but right. pretty soon after he killed these two girls, uh, a police officer, he was checking through gun licenses. And the way they found this, too, is very interesting. Yeah. Is that this, so his, his record was expunged for killing his grandparents. And so they were going through, and they were going through driver's licenses because they basically with the, if there's like a random sweep where they go through a bunch of gun like gun license things like forms and shit and make sure everything's up to date and everything's up to par and they were going through and they're like oh Eddie Kemper oh yeah that big fucking the bubble butters was hanging out and being annoying <laughs> I, right? I remember like, him yeah. I was like yeah it's just here it's like what is this thing and they noticed that back in the day instead of issuing a new card they literally would just cross out your record on, yeah, on they the bu- card they'd black it out kind of like uh, you know redacted on uh, right. classified but it was like form. with a marker yeah and so he's like, what does it say underneath this thing? And he looks at it, and basically he sees through the marker that he was put into an insane asylum.